Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Baidu's Gate. The Gatening. The Gatening. Tales of the Sword Coast, which, as I was told, is like it's it's actually late, very late in the game. Does that come in the expansion? Uh, so it's pretty pointless right now, but whatever. Right, right. And for whatever reason, the player decide we should move in the T formation. For the T formation. Because uh, I pity British. the fool. I pity the fool who doesn't walk in a T formation. <laughs> you pity the fool. Welcome to the friendly arm. I trust you know the rules of conduct, Mr. In. There are rules. What kind of rules? I like how Jay asked that. Like, <laughs> there are rules. What the fuck is this? Uh, Communist country. <laughs> Perhaps rules is a touch too formal. It is unwritten, but accepted that while herein you will act with the utmost of civility to all as a guest. This is a neutral ground that all grievances are left at the gate. If the grievances come in, then you will go out. Enjoy your stay. That doesn't sound like an unwritten rule to <laughs> You're me. You're not allowed to kill each other, <laughs> unwrittenly. <laughs> yes. Uh, unlike the unwritten rule of gaming, which is don't be a dick, basically. <laughs> That's the rule? Like most people haven't heard that one. Yeah, I know, seriously. Just, yes, events look really weird in this game, just take that. Yeah. Just kind of stay, they look a bit like zombies, actually. <laughs> they kind of, they kind of do, don't they? They're just all like being zombies. So where, where are we off to, my good pair? I'm going into the inn to get the allies who are not evil and crazy. Oh yeah, I wonder if they're gonna have some disagreement with our current allies. Yeah, actually, they might. I have never done this, but first there's yeah. this guy. You can read him. Hi, friend. I've not seen you here before today. What brings you to the friendly arm? Nothing much, really. Just a road-worn a road -worn traveler looking for a place to rest. I'm here to meet some friends. I'm not your friend and my business is my own. <laughs> I'm not your friend, buddy. <laughs> I'm not your buddy, friend, <laughs> guy, something. Uh, anyway, what do you want to answer? Let's see. Um... I'll... I'm just... let's do two, I guess. Oh, you must be whom I am to meet, then. I will take you to your friends. But first, I should be sure you're the correct person. Is your name Lunashine? <laughs> it's, your... it's funny that you can go ahead and just be like, No, I'm not Lunashine, but say yes. Perfect! You're indeed the person I seek. Hold still a moment, won't you? Yeah, he tries to fucking murder you. You're not really <laughs> good at this whole running away from people who try to kill you. The first time, I actually, I, I think I ended up, um, like, I, 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 I just went with the, like, um, oh, I'm just, like, a traveling person. Traveling, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know if it was because of my look at but he always tried to murder me with my last character. There was literally nothing I could say. Like, even wow. if I just said him, go the fuck away, he's like, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> what a dick. So he's actually like he he had to. That's why he kept saving because he like killed me so many times before. Uh, I have no idea if this four people is not gonna be as much of a problem because it, okay that works. I just kill him. <laughs> well, Normally he does like mirror images and then it becomes a pain. Yeah, but you did so much damage with your freaking thing. Yeah. There's to be no fighting or stealing within the side of the war. It's friendly, I'm in. Aggressor will be punished to folks like that's how they don't do much. Like I, I actually have run away like this far and they still bash to let him kill me. This they're very wow. bad at this. They're they're pretty bad at their jobs. I'm glad you picked up those guys and they, they actually helped me out here. Yeah. Because this they was a pain to do last time. Yeah, I'm glad to, I'm glad to hear they were actually useful. Cause yeah. If they weren't, I'd be like, well, I'm actually not sure pieces. why the guy died so fast. I, mean, she... um, I don't know. What I mean? can't stand the way the roads are cut off these days. Me uncle's in Baldur's Gates and I can't get to see him. You can. I mean, I'm just gonna let you voice, voice of, like, not voice, but um, answer. What, what do you want to say? How come the roads oh. are cut off? What does your uncle do? How come the roads are cut off? Where have, where have you been these past few months? The roads are crawling with brigands and bandits after every scrap of iron ye got on ye. Surely you must have fled some on your trip here, lest you come by the west road, that is. Well, for your sake and mine, I hope the roads are clear up soon. I see you around, why the west road is still open. 
Yeah, that's not sad, actually. If there's ever a book shortage, that road to Candlekeep will be the most dangerous of them all, I assure you. These folks are after metal, so they're sticking mainly to the larger trade routes between Baldur's Gate and Amon... and... Amon. <laughs> Guess what? This here inn is smack dab in the middle of it all. Dup, dup, dup. Thanks for this exposition. I'm actually gonna turn the game up slightly. Hey, Not you much, can but... you can do that if you wish. Just don't turn it up too much, or I'll I'll have to do things to you. Yeah. The only problem is like most of it is um, written, but sometimes like, like for example that guard. I'm pretty sure you said something after you finished that fight, but I have no idea what he said. Yeah. He was probably just like, hey. So there's always a guy in every tavern who always sounds the same who just says, I need some air, like every two minutes, it just gets wow. really annoying. That sounds really annoying. Uh, I need some ale. Okay, so let's go talk to these people. Greetings, you. You look familiar. Though it's not your looks, I am sure what I expected. But I believe you're Gorian's child. I am Jaira, and this is Khalid. Good to know you. We are old friends of your adopted father. He is not with you? I must assume the worst. He would not permit his only child to wander without- This is a woman, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> How did you tell? Oops. I <laughs> I don't know. I just remember there. There's a guy and a woman, and the guy is a, is a scared one. Yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Man, it's a very manly woman. I can tell you that one at least. Yeah. Hmm. Let me try and get. Let me try and channel my inner manly woman. Let's inner go. Amazon. This, the Amazonas. Which I never got that super redundant, but anyways. Hmm. He would do it, not only... No. <laughs> I'm just gonna say no. But no. <clears throat> he wouldn't... He... Just... If you can read him as a guy, you want to. Just say he had a sex change. <laughs> a really bad one. Your face had a face change. It's a really... A really... It, your but face... Like, woman was... does not look like me, I give you that much. Your, your face was in face-off. Fair. <laughs> he would not permit his only child to wander without his accompaniment. That's bad. If if he has passed, we share your laws. I like how that's the first thing he thinks. <laughs> like if he's dead. <laughs> no, no, yeah. he, he got he went out to get some make. Oh, okay then. <laughs> uh, Gorian said often that he would word it. <laughs> he would words. <laughs> he would bald null my tongue. It got <laughs> stuck between my teeth again. Uh, but he would worried for your safety, even at the expense of his own. He also wished that Khalid and I would become your guardians if you should ever meet an untimely end. However, you are much older now, and the choice of your companion should be your own. We could to travel with you until you get settled. Hey, we find you lot, lot in life. Your company would be very calm. It would rather... be fitting last service to oh, Gorion, though we should first go to Nakishel. Khalid and I look into local concerns, and there are rumors of strange happenings at the mine. No doubt you have heard of the iron shortage. You would do well to help us, or else we'll kill you. I mean, if <laughs> it affects everyone, including you, we are to meet the mayor of this town, Burn Gastkill. See, everyone is like to meet the fucking mayor in that town. That fucking name, though, Baron Gas Gaskill. That <laughs> <laughs> name. Uh, Shadows. Maybe. Your company would be very calm. I would rather choose my own future and leave Gorin's past by me. I, this would make sense if not for the fact that like every motherfucker is trying to assassinate you. Yeah, I know. Seriously. Like, I, I just want to like forget about the old guy who died to save me. Yeah, yeah. It's it's. Dumb. I find my way on my own. I'm ready. 
I'm already going to Nazca. My current companions wish to visit there as well. The first one. Actually, I want to see what she says to that. Yeah, yeah. Some hazel. Indeed, interesting. In that case, I think we should definitely travel as one. Can never be too careful of the dangers of the open road, wherever they may spring from. I think she has already figured this out better than my main character. Yeah, I think so too. Oh yeah, also she breaks the force wall. She does. Yeah, if you accept him, when she when you select her. Currently, she's not doing it. <laughs> uh, she's trolling me. Oh, what a troll! Yes, yes, because she's like, yes, omnipresent authority figure. <laughs> wow. <laughs> she's pretty badass. She's actually like, she's super much experience compared to everyone else. Yeah, like, see. She, cause she's like the only guy, woman I, and she's the only level up I've ever seen. Wow, holy crap, the warrior's OP, look at that armor class. Here's another one, yeah, no, that, that's what I said before, he like never gets like, if, if you have a warrior fighting a warrior, they just kinda don't hit each other. <laughs> yeah. But it's mostly because he's wearing actually heavy armor. Cause he actually oh. has the same armor stats as this guy, who's a actually base ones. Actually, I think mm -hmm. he might have worse than the other one. Cause he has a negative two, I think this guy's negative three, yeah. So you see, he has negative two. Mm -hmm. But he vang um spin may and then a right, habit. Right. Which <laughs> doesn't actually add to the armor class. But it yeah. makes him but immune it to crit. To me, yeah, which makes him even more OP. So, yeah. uh, so we got a great party going on here. Yep, we sure do. Look at all the extreme stuff we can do now. We have actually six people. We also picked up a bunch of stuff from the dead, guys. Yeah, America. Um. Stuff. Oh yeah, they had the scores that they already had learned. There's magic missile. Oh yeah, we should be trying to learn it. Um, the thing is, it's I have the band of magic missile, which kind of does the same oh. thing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And it does. It's a, an infinite use item. Yes. Okay. Then yeah, yeah. There's no point in actually getting. Wow. Can you just next? I have a bunch of scores I could try to learn, but I'm not gonna learn anything just because I've actually I can't learn like most skills at the same time. If you know what I mean. Right, right. You can't like. There's no point in learning more level one skills at the moment. Yeah. Um. She also has priest scores. I don't know why the druid has wow. priest first, but yes. I don't know. She can also memorize one more spot than us. What yeah. a whore. She's, she's super OP. Why is, she, why is she so OP? Why do you hate that so much? <laughs> I don't know, because I want to be a super awesome person who's OP. So I'm going to go for all the buffs first. Because she actually has cure light wounds, like I said earlier in the game. Yeah. Sounds, sounds reasonable. So now I have six people. I don't. I don't actually hate that. I mean, it's good to have a useful person at our party. It's, she's so OP, though. I yeah. can't handle it. I mean, she also has um, twelve HP. <laughs> yeah, she has is so much she, Yeah. She actually she currently doesn't have yet, but when she levels up, she has more HP than the knight. Yeah. Um. Mm. Iron is the lifeblood of this whole region, and it's sure painful when it gets scarce. So what can I do for ya? What do you have to sell? I want to see if he actually has any. Like, I could probably say some useful stuff. I'm gonna what are you buying? Do you want me to say the gem? Yeah, the it's all the gems. Okay. That's a bunch of coin. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Uh, wow, we could get some books. Yeah, but I don't know what books actually do. I assume you read them and that's yeah, I like. I can you already read them like this. Oh wow, okay, then I don't know. Just if anyone asks for a book, you can buy it for him, but besides that, I guess it's kind of useless. What I like about this game is actually the fact that you can like, switch directly between the mode shows you what they can use. Yeah. Which some of the modern games cannot do. <laughs> yeah, I know, that is pretty legit. Which actually reminds me, um. I'm gonna go buy some of those. So, can his armor class go below one? Yes. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> Pretty sure later in the game, Mom Plus easily goes below one. I assume so, because I was actually going to say, did he have a shield? Because if not, you should get him a shield. Um, actually, I think he has a shield, but I'm probably going to... The thing is, like, now that I have these guys, I have to look at this differently, but before I give him a bow. 
and there's a bit it's a bit dumb you can't like even though technically the sword is one hand you have to mm. take out the sword yeah you have to take out the shit even if like always take out the shit he can't switch between the shit and then and with the sword oh yeah yeah because they have the it's... quick weapons but the quick weapons mm. don't tie with the shit this is... that makes sense yeah that makes sense it is silly that you can't put the shield on a quick weapon slot so it, it gives plus one to the armor class yeah but i wanted to see his stats because he, i know he has he has one in bow two in large source one in axe yeah he should definitely use a, a sword yeah but he has two in missile two, she has two in missile he has what so i mean technically he could use a bow and then a two-hand sword yeah. Oh, yeah. If you want to give him both, that's fine for any range stuff. I was just more saying he should normally be a sword guy because, um, well, you want your tank taking the damage or yeah. not taking the damage as the case is likely, but you know, dodging the damage. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna see him. Oh, the only other thing is you can't see the weapons equipped. Yeah. So I mean, it did that so you wouldn't accidentally sell it. But at the same time, it's a bit annoying. Yeah, yeah. I, I, that, I see what you mean, because it's like, well, I'd at least like to be able to check on the stats of it, so I know how good it is. Yeah, the two-handed sword is a derivative of the long sword. Weapons have always looked for ways to improve existing weapons. In an effort to improve the long sword, the blade was lengthened, and eventually the handle had to be extended, and two hands became necessary to properly swing the sword. The primary function of the two-hand sword is Cleaving mountain knight, mounted knights and waking up pike formations. <laughs> Cleaving mountain knights. Yes, mountain don't, knights. We don't like those mountain knights. It's a large sword, so he could use it. It's yeah. 1d10, which 10 speed. And his base sword is... No, I don't want to talk to you. His base sword is um, a long sword, which I think we already read about that. Because we yeah. read about it, yeah. It's 1d8 with speed factor 5. I don't know if high speed vector or low speed vector is good. No idea. A speed vector 4 on a staff. Hmm. So I assume high speed factor is good. Speed vector 2. I know, I think lower is better because the dagger is 2. Yeah, yeah, okay, you're right. So. The sword so is 1d8, the other one is 1d10, but mm -hmm. the other one is speed vector 10. One... Yeah, this one swings twice as fast. But so if it works like that, unless it's like some kind of other formula. Like, I don't know if yeah. 5 to 10 is actually double or whatever. I don't know. Technically, oh uh, yeah. Technically, it should be, but I don't know. You're right. But So I guess I wouldn't buy it personally. Yeah, probably not. Um... I guess you could just give the elves a go. I don't need a second archer right now, at least. Yeah. Like, if she yeah. dies, then maybe, but. Whatever. You're gonna try to not have her die. I'm, I'm gonna try to not have her die, but. Maybe I'm just gonna keep rolling if she does. <laughs> keep. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, um, But anyways, that's fine. Like, it, hel it helps the archers not die anyway, just having having the guy with the shields. So, I guess as long we as you keep him in front. Ah, uh, yeah, sounds legit. Do we want to rest peasant, merchant, noble, or royal? Do they actually do anything different? Um, you end up getting more HP points back. But oh. it doesn't matter much because my guys are barely wounded. Yeah, I just rest peasant then. Rest. And it did say he has a 1 HP point. He rested yeah. for 8 hours. Your face is 8 hours. I don't know. Awesome formation. <laughs> yep. Miss formation. Get into get into cluster formation. <laughs> Must gather your party before going forth. You didn't see that. Um, so I guess I, there's probably other stuff you can do here. I just haven't actually done anything here ever before. Okay. No, I no idea. But um, because yeah. normally we would move south now. Hmm. Unless we want to hang out this town and just go molest everyone. <laughs> like I'm, no, I'm in no mood to speak with you. Get out of my face! What a bitch! Did you smell me? You should go side questing though. I don't know. Side quests are never a bad thing. But then again, but there's things I don't know if they are side quests. Yeah, I don't know. Normally in this type of game, I'd assume there's side quests in every town, but I'm not really sure. Let's go and talk to me. 
It's probably an assassin. Yep. For a bit of respectful coin, we can cure what ails thee if you need. Oh, I guess. It's only an assassin. <laughs> what sort yeah. of cures do you have available? She's a, she says you're peace purse. Well, I guess they're not oh, peace purse because I can use them too, but you know what I mean. Yeah, you could buy Ray's dead though. That might not be a but bad idea. But it's a flavor for a spell. Oh, wow! Well, you know, you still might want to buy it in advance. It's right, it's very far advanced. Yeah. I think you can only go up to level ten in this game. Yeah. Oh, okay, so it's not in the normal level twenty. Yeah, I, I think it's level ten, but maybe it's level twenty. I've 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 never gone. I've not leveled up once in this damn game. <laughs> uh yeah, leveling seems like it'd be pretty freaking slow. Can I leave? <laughs> <laughs> and then they all died. <laughs> yeah. You're having a little trouble with that it's a leaving thing. Yeah. It's apparently the only problem with having so many people. It's just it's the way the party moves. Yeah. Maybe I should split up the party. <laughs> Yeah, come to think of it, maybe your main character shouldn't actually be in the front of the party. It looks cool. It does look cool, but, you know, I, whatever. <laughs> it's over looking cool and blue. <laughs> Wait, actually, are we now a villain from that one game we have been playing? <laughs> oh, Ghost Trick. Yes. <laughs> I don't know, maybe. Maybe it'll turn out that we get, like, a quest to assassinate some dude. And then we get crushed by a giant bowling ball. Oh, wasn't a bowling that'd be ball. sad. I like these like, guards in this game, I'll tell you. <laughs> and Sounds they yawn all right. day. Like, I get yawning yeah. at night, but they yawn, like, it's like, early morning. Like, it's midday. You don't yawn in yeah, midday wow. unless you're a green bean. <laughs> That's pretty ridiculous, huh? Unless you're a green bean. Yep, I I guess I do yawn a lot, but certainly not Oblivion Guards. You don't break the law on my watch. <laughs> Criminal scum. Damn, those guys had like energy. Those might be like the best guards in the void, technically. Huh? Those are like the best guards in the void. Yeah, I, I think they They're are. They invested in their job. Imagine, imagine if the police were like that, like... Just walk into someone's shop and you pick something up and they're just running in there like stop criminal scum. I'm gonna go with Scott a bit to the right here. Well, I'm just leaving the map. Yeah, yeah. Do do do. Anyone? Sounds pretty reasonable. Though I think you were the one who was telling me that they sometimes glitch out in weird ways. I'm like uh. Um, leaving glitches out in weird ways sometimes. Well. Yeah, that's true. I just, I think, I think you're the one who was telling me about one time you, like, was, they killed, like, something, and then you came by and there was a dead thing and you took the arrows, and they, like, were, they came after you, because you took their arrows. Yeah, actually, I don't know if I said that, but I do know that some of the kids thinks that, like, who killed this person? <laughs> like, you. Yeah, <laughs> that's pretty funny. Uh <laughs> Yeah, that's also sometimes was very useful to just wait for one of them to die fighting him for one stand and just taking their shit. <laughs> yeah, they did like early game I think they had some of the best stuff like yeah. in the game. So I guess I guess can I leave through this? So yeah, the, the map doesn't look that big, but from what I've been told you can actually keep going to the right like quite a bit. Yeah. Makes sense. Like here I could go to the right if I I, I, I wanted to go No wait, actually you can still go down. Yeah, I thought you could only go to the blue areas, but I think the blue areas are just the new ones. Ah, yeah, that makes So sense. can I just travel directly, or do I... no. How does I this work? I have to actually I... go to the edge of the screen. Right, right, you have to go to the corresponding edge of the screen. Do -do. Uh, we are on an epic quest with like, six people. <laughs> Two of them might or might not try to kill me. This is... But yeah. As long as I rest in the town, I'm pretty sure they're not gonna try to kill me. Yeah, as long as you what? As long as I rest in a town. So oh. Likely that would try to carry me in the middle of a town. Yeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure they're not going to. They probably will eventually confront you when you start start not being a bad guy. Oh, well, maybe they're actually assassins who hired to carry me, but they take really smart about it. <laughs> that seems pretty unlikely in this game. Hmm. Considering that every, like, assassin, like, actually thinking that 
What are some of these assassins' plans? Like that one who attacked you in the middle of town, even assuming he managed to kill you. Okay. Like I have no idea what he does. Fucking. What does it? Wow. Just can you guys? I have no idea what's going on. Damn, he just took like two critical hits to the face. Yeah, he did. Wow. That's a, that would explain why he took so much damage. I was wondering. Woman, hear that bitch. He just kind of started crying like a bitch. <laughs> I'm not sure I can blame him. He got shot with two <laughs> arrows in the face. God damn, this game is intense. <laughs> it's pretty intense. Uh, but yeah. you can you can do it. Kill the archers. No, I'm dead. Can you make him not dead? Nah, he's dead. Oh. <laughs> Boom! Wow. So you can't make him not dead until level 5? God, I'm being attacked by bandits now. Um, I, I heard that you can make them not dead by him going to a cleric. So maybe we could do that. Okay. But we, it costs we... a lot of money, obviously. Oh, yeah. Well, okay. If you want to leave him dead, I don't know. I mean, it's based on how much I want to try to Iron Man this shit. <laughs> I mean, well, in a way, it makes it more dramatic, but I don't know how long this would go. Yeah, I mean... I don't think you should full try to Iron Man it, because... Nah, Iron Manning doesn't really work well with recording, in my opinion. It's boring fast when you gotta redo anything. But maybe yeah, that's so just, just why. decide not to redo stuff and we end whenever I die. <laughs> well, yeah, okay, there's that option. <laughs> okay, so. Well, this was kinda. Can you get out of the way, Bob? <laughs> You're a terrible woman, you didn't hear him fast enough. I mean, yeah, I did kind of panic because I had no idea what the hell happened. <laughs> I understand you panicking. You just take, suddenly took two crits to the face. And then he got shot again, like, he got hit four times in a row. Yep. The question is, do I go back to the Fundy Army? Because I know that they had a priest woman, like, I talked to the priest, remember? Yeah, I remember I that. guess I'm gonna go back now. Okay. Because I don't know if any of the towns in the cells are fine. But I mean, like, why the goblins and then the bandits out of nowhere, too? <laughs> and then I, and now I'm getting attacked. What is this? <laughs> uh... Just everyone wants my fucking face. They seriously do. Lightning boy. I mean, whatever it's named. Burning hands. No, I meant the other thing. The, magic the god. Yeah, magic missile. Shoot magic missile at the darkness. God. Can you guys not hit my? Here, guys, like a party of six. Can how can you guys not defend the mage out of all of my people? Thank you. Oh. Maybe because the mage is in the front of the formation. <laughs> I was kind of going to say that. <laughs> uh... Damn, this was like the most epic journey ever. Like I left <laughs> town and then like a minute in the, like where you guys are crying, running back to town. Like this was terrible. <laughs> uh, it was kind of an unfortunate journey. Oh, well, yeah, at, least we guys. at least we didn't have to fight any killer rabbits. Not yet. Yeah. That's um, I don't, I don't know if that's a thing in this game. It's, it's funny. That's actually um, one of the early on enemies in, freaking um, King's Quest, not uh, Quest for Glory Four. Oh, I sound the same. <laughs> <laughs> King's Quest, Quest for Glory, same thing. I I get the mixed up, but the basic difference is that King's Quest doesn't have any combat system. And it's doesn't just have any RPG elements. Yeah, exactly. No RPG elements at all. Quest for Glory is heavy, heavy RPG with adventure game stuff, too. Yep. Well, that one going on. He was my other mage. He was yeah. he was kind of chaotic either, though. Yeah, that's why. That's more of why I was concerned, maybe. We shouldn't revive him, maybe. When the other guy backstabs us, we should be just like, well, you know, your friend died. I can't died. do it. want to give them a chance to backstab me before I just let them die. <laughs> if you if you insist, I don't know. It sounds kind of fair. Uh, does it? Does it sound fair? They, they can't really kill people for no reason before they've done anything. 
<laughs> I guess, yeah. Can you like, can you actually revive dead people? I mean, I have a bandit scope. Does that help me? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Clearly, his bandit scalp. Just maybe I have to give him donations. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, there was this. There was this. That reminds me of um, um, another. Oh yeah, we were actually doing that together. Remember that PS1 game, um, with the guy who transformed? Oh yeah, Threads of Fate. The church doesn't do shit in that game unless you donate to it. <laughs> Sounds reasonable. <laughs> Sounds like every church ever. Yeah, yeah. They have an elixir of healing. But it only has, like, ten points. It doesn't <laughs> revive the dead. Why do you have <laughs> not an elixir of revive the dead? <laughs> yeah, where's all of your elixirs of reviving people? Seriously, what's wrong with you guys? I mean, he kind of, he was nice, right? He, he was a good guy. Yeah, yeah, he was, he was. Whoa. Huh? Oh, okay, never mind. My my screen just dirt lagged for a second, and he like disappeared off of your party slot. I was like, is he officially dead now? He does whenever I go into that into him buying stuff, so I can't select him. Oh, okay, makes sense. So what? Oh yeah, I said we didn't read the score. Hmm. I know we did. Oh. No, I don't know. I think. Don't. No, I don't think so. So let's see. Bounty notice. Be it known to all those of evil intent. Wow. That's pretty straightforward. Uh, be, be, yes. That a bounty has been placed upon the head of Luna Shine, the foster child of Gorion. Last seen in the area of Candle Keep. This person is to be killed in quick order. Uh, those returning with proof of the deed shall. <laughs> Shall receive no less than 200 coins of gold. I'm like, uh, seriously? <laughs> I have made more gold. Yeah, that's like nothing. As always, any that reveal these plans and forces of law shall join the target in their fate. Can't I? Like, why don't I do that? I am kind of, like, already the target, right? Yeah, seriously. Anyway, and this I... is a good place to end, I think. Yeah, I think so, but I did have to say, it's actually kind of silly what it go about, just here, have these scrolls. It's not like that's suspicious. It's not like, it's not like just anyone could give them to the, to the guards. Yeah, I have no idea how this, this is supposed to work, but hey, all of evil intent, you know where to go. <laughs> yep. Uh, I should, I should keep that in mind. Yep. Anyways, thank y'all for watching. See you guys next time.